make a, cu a custom scenery object, so I hope you like it. First of all, we got to open SketchUp. And go to your plugins, RCT3, placement, full tile. And you should press something like this. Then just draw it, f just draw over it and drag it up until distances 4 meters, exactly like that. Now then, the next thing you need to do is just get rid of the tile. Just get rid of the tile. It's very, very, very bad to have it on. And now, if you accidentally import that tile, it can crash the game badly. So now fi click File, Import. And then find a texture, but the texture has to be 512 times 512. So I'm going to choose stone texture and open it. You should have this, and then, then just drag it to the size you want. Then you should go to your paint bucket and click in model and place it on all sides of the object. Now then, you have this object. So now just link it all up. Group, under the info. Now click on this thing here and you should come up with your texture that you used and click OK. Name the texture. I'm just going to name it something basic like B I O B I O B because that's all I've got time to write. So it just that won't come up in game, so nobody will know. So now you just go to plugins, ASC exporter, export, and make sure they're both on yes. If they don't know that it won't work, then now go to documents, create a new file, and name it something decent. For example, D S O, and then open it. Rename your for we just save it as it is. Never mind about this part. Okay, then just click OK. So just have a quick scroll around, and your model should look something similar like this. Hopefully, yours will be better looking than mine. Now we just need to close SketchUp. You don't need to save it. Now then, uh, if you don't have RCG3 Importer, is like this program here. First of all, you go to Start Google Chrome. Now, I Google. I'm just why have you call it Google? It might take a little while. And now, what you want to type in? Is something like this. Ah. Oh. Then you want this one. As you've searched our CT3 portal, so come up with this. And just click download. And then it should come up with this website, which is just loading, called Search Wars Net. And then you go down to RCT3 Importer and then go down and you want this file here just select that one because that one doesn't work so just select this one and then that and then it should just pop up there as a download 
once it's finished downloading click on it and the file should open it should be called the RCT3 importer zip then the thing you want is RCT3 importer exe so open that now just select your theme so what theme are you going to have it um, that's your choice i go for generate the whole time because i like it then just call it something basic something like p o o p l m then apostrophe s pull moons just basically then just type in block you don't have to type in that but that's what I do because this is in, because um, that's what I want to call it so then now you want to go to create reveal then you should come up click the plus in the textures box find the texture you used I used stone texture, so OK, and click OK. If it doesn't come up with um, just that, um, it that means you haven't um, put it, you ha it isn't a resolution of the power of 2. For example, it has to be 512 times 512. Now you want to go to static models and click the plus in that. Go down to your left handed Z up and run the file that you had. So, I, you know, I don't know, see, so open it. Now, find the texture you put, put it in there. Okay. And then all you need to do is just click the and then name it so I'm calling it block and now just click create saving your OVL say, and it should say save OVL successful click OK and just um, save load, load any texture you want but it still has to be by 512 um, when you want to choose, okay. Close. Like on references. Auto and close. Text string. Anything you want. Look. V. Close. Scene. Well, this is what you've got to say over here. Which do you want? We. Bowman's. Bowman's uh, block. Come on over here. Spin. The eye thing. And that one's. Try. Just select. Thing one will find and just don't put anything you want, just place just put it in if I'm going to put it as in a tree. I don't know why I'm not going to put it in a tree. Actually, I'm going to put it in as a medium. Try and do it always some scenery. I'm going to do large scenery now. Extra parameters, none. Keep support types none. Now then, you need to be good at this because you've got to do, got to do zero, 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 four, 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 and then one. Oh, oops, made a mistake there. One. Placement flag for tile. Now, unknown one, unknown zero. Just select those two for that. When you get to here, then you just type in, or do it slowly, zero. Just zero the whole way down.
so and you should have this right now so if you can see it okay then just click ok then close if it doesn't come up back to this I haven't done any I haven't done it right so then now we need to click is install and then ok close the file and uh, I'd just like to say a big thank you for watching today this is this is my first tutorial please comment and rate thank you for watching bye